welcome back to the channel this will be an update to the roi video so let's take a look at how my castle's kingdom is doing today now i had recently had a comment on my last video i think the comment was from today and the person was saying that castles is down and that over the last 30 days it's not doing so good the last seven days it's not doing so good uh this couldn't be further from the truth so let's take a look castles let's see this is four hours so we got four eight twelve so there's six candles in a day we got one two three four five six that's one day so we're doing pretty good one two three four five six that's another day one two three four five six so over the last few days m source is booming absolutely booming here we go one two three four five six one two three four five six i mean you can see m source has been taking off i've been telling people in in a few discords like hey m source is getting ready to go up because there's a big event coming up soon and if you're unaware about the event i'll have a link down below where you can get more information about it but you have got to see that castles is pretty much at all-time high if not very close it's pretty much right there back again it's hard to do that it really is very difficult so with the upcoming event people are holding their m sores not selling as much and they're going to be consuming it more very soon because there's going to be a second use case for it it's going to be a mad dash we are going to smash all-time highs with m source that is just what i believe you should do your own research but i'm thinking we smash this 13 this uh zero zero thirteen we're gonna go it's gonna go higher it's gonna go higher i don't know where it's gonna go but i i'm pretty sure it's gonna go higher so i think for at least at least 10 days it's gonna be pumping now let's take a look at the last roi video look at that handsome guy right there the last video i did m source let's see where are we at here M source was at 0011. So we're up even from this video. I let's okay. So here's the old ROI. Not counting barons. Let's see if I throw the barons in there. I got some point I do. There we go. So there's 37 a day with the barons. That's my old ROI. I'll just take there we go. I'm still working on the interface. Sorry, it's not quite where I want it yet. You can see I'm trying to do some cool things on the screen. Uh, work in progress. Now, old ROI, 37 a day, 256 a week. Now the new one, $65 a day. That's partially because I'm, I have a bigger kingdom in my castle so far. Like I have more lands, okay? It's not that much more. I think I had 4160 at the time of my other video, and I have 4700 M source an hour now. So the kingdom has grown, but not by that much, not by double. But you can see here that my daily profit, my potential daily profit, has doubled or nearly doubled. We're at 65 a day, and the old one was at 37 a day. And this is with Barons. So this is pretty cool. So what was that? 800 and something wax a week. It is now 1620 wax a week. That is awesome. And a total 30 day of 1976. And that's if I wanted to pull out my money every day. That's about what I would get. Um, 30 days is definitely a long way out in crypto. But we know, or at least game theory suggests, that the price is only going to go up over these next two weeks. Now, when will people take profits? Is everyone, if everyone's using M source and everyone's holding M source and some people selling, not everybody, but some people selling, when will it take a dip? Probably a few days before the lumberjack sale ends. Honestly, that's what I think. I think that it's going to pump for almost two weeks and then people are going to start taking profits and you know, it'll dip a little bit. That's okay though. We're going to have times where we, you know, go up and down, but, uh, for the most part, they've built a beautiful system here. The game theory is working 
exactly like they predicted and I couldn't be any I couldn't be any happier. I'm earning $65 potentially a day from a game. That is so awesome. I couldn't be any more excited about this. Um, as you can see, I do have a, a castle now. I was able to combine those cities into a castle. And I picked up a ton of villages actually today. Now, my previous, previously, I had not ROI'd in my last video. However, I have ROI'd now. I ROI'd previously until today. Today, I did buy some more villages. So that's what I do. I, I dollar cost average in. I don't I don't put in any more I can, than I can afford to lose. And that's my plan. So that's my plan. That's what I do. I DCA. I don't lump sum because I don't have a lump sum. You know, like some of you guys out there too, right? You, you feel me. I just, you know, a little bit out of each check goes a long way especially in the right game so i'm glad i'm hanging in on this game i roi'd once before and now i recently just just bought in some more so reinvested i guess as you would say i'm just having fun with it so i'm excited i currently earn almost 113,000 m mSORs a day that is freaking awesome and that's it that's my castles update if you're not in this game your window I would I would say it's not closing, but this may be a decent time still to, to get in before the event starts. So uh, do your own research, see why this game works. Look into the white paper, read it for yourself, or go back and watch my 30 minute video. I read the whole white paper. I never do that because it's boring, right? I did it this one time because it's so dang important to understand this game and why it works and why it probably will continue to work in the in the long term so so that's it that's the roi update video if you're not in castles maybe you should be this is definitely one of the projects that uh that i love so a minute um in it in it <clears throat> you yeah.